Hey everyone, I just wanted to do a quick video showing all the updates I've made to the UHF Pi TV station project. Uh, so I've got my black and white portable TV set up here and I've got my web uh, remote, which is part of the project on the left. And uh, I'm just going to show off some of the features. So right off the bat, I've got the TV running uh, with nothing broadcasting. I'm going to go ahead and turn the power on. There we go. You can see a show called Bits and Bytes, the UK computer show is on. Uh, it shows you what episode is playing, and um, as I showed before, you can play and pause. Uh, you can fast forward, of course, and rewind. And when you skip episodes, I added a little extra polish here. Let's, uh, skip the episode, and you see it's got the like the color calibration bars that come up. And I thought that was a nice touch. Now, you can switch channels by using channel up and down, and you can switch episodes of a TV show by hitting forward and backwards. Um, before, if you hit channel up or channel down, um, you would have to wait for each episode to load, or else the uh, OMX player would crash. And this was very tedious trying to get through to episodes further down the list. So first off, I um, added this number pad. This number pad lets you actually just type in which episode number you want to go to. And that's okay. You know, I want to go to episode uh, four. So I can type in maybe like 04. And you see it waits a second, confirms the input, and then changes. But what I also did is I added a, um, it's called a debouncing or a throttling mechanism that lets me um, here, I'm just going to demonstrate it. I'm going to hit forward a bunch, and you can see it's showing me episode 5, 6, 7, 8, and so on. And it's not actually changing the channel yet. So this lets me just, you know, do whatever I want. And it's like, okay, episode 10. And then you wait for a moment. It queues up that uh, request and then submits it. Same with uh, switching episode or um, channels. So from bits and bytes, I can go to Electric Playground. And you see for a moment it shows you the playlist and then it shows you the episode. So here let's switch to uh, G4 Icons, Computer Chronicles, yeah, Screen Savers. Now, I added a few other buttons here. Uh, this, if this uh, information becomes stale, maybe you change the uh, channel uh, on a different computer, you can just hit refresh and it'll update the display. Uh, or if something goes horribly wrong and the program is hung or crashed, you can hit eject and that'll kind of like reboot the system. Pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I've preloaded up a config file with a bunch of era appropriate TV shows. Obviously the project doesn't come with the TV shows, um, but it just maybe gives you an idea of some cool stuff to watch. <laughs> Seacoast DSV. Let's end it on that note. Uh, so when you hit power off, it'll actually, um, pause whatever uh, program is already playing. So here, I'll switch it back to like screen savers here and I'll power it down. Tells you that the transmitter is offline. You can see it's all static up here and I turn it back on. It's going to uh, unpause it and power up the transmitter. All right, thanks for checking out the project. Head on over to github.com slash shake with three s's s s s h a k e and it's the pi uhf tv station uh project